how are you all doing in this video we are going to talk about the watch os 9.6.1 and is it worth updating to this firmware or not what all things does this update bring on your watch and what all new changes are here my name is jay you are watching tech hype if you are new here consider hitting that subscribe button because i keep on making these type of videos for you guys and you guys seem to love these so make sure to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already so the watch os 9.6.1 is basically a refinement update this update brings only one thing that is focused on stability and bug fixes always the 0.6 the three point updates i mean the 9.6.1 the 9.5.1 where whenever there are two points in an update and three numbers that update is the most refined version available so 9.6.1 is focused on the battery life improvement so hope so i haven't really tested it yet because it's barely been any or time that i have been using my watch on this firmware i will let you guys know my usage after a few days so make sure to hit that subscribe button the battery life will be really really good on this update then the next thing is bug fixes there were some bug fixes for example notifications coming late on the screen and the notification panel bugging that was a bug on 9.6 there was also a bug when you were switching uh, the watch faces there was some lag on my watch I talked to some of my subscribers on Twitter and you guys said the same there was this bug and now it is resolved here. There isn't anything new feature wise in this update but yes this update does bring small changes and refinement and bug fixes. That is all this update is focused on. The answer is you should yes go ahead and install this update on your watch. This update is really good it brings a lot of refinement and bug fixes and it is completely worth installing this update on your watch now talking about the performance the performance seems to be a little bit better on this version as well of course on watch it is really hard to test performance but i do play some small games on my watch and those games work really well and the performance seems to be pretty much the same but yeah scrolling through the ui feels noticeably smoother on this update i don't know if that is the case or not but it feels a little bit more smoother and the animation speeds are a bit faster and everything feels a little bit more fluid the size of this update was around 250 mb on my watch it will depend on which version you are coming from and which watch you are using for me it was apple watch se so it may vary for you if you have a different watch or you are coming from a different version after installing this version i have noticed that my watch got around 120 mbs of storage back that is a good thing if an update brings you back some storage that is a positive sign that means that this version is really optimized there isn't anything a lot to talk about here what's going on in the watch os 9.6.1 there is a lot of things to talk about in the watch os 10 beta 6 so let me know down in comments below are you on watch os 10 or are you waiting for the watch os 10 public release the public beta of watch os 10 will be out really soon i will post a video once the public beta will be out so make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications that's pretty much it for today's quick little episode thank you so much for watching this video till the end my name is jay you are watching tech hyped if you are watching this video till the end thank you so much i really love this that you watched this video till the end make sure to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already i will catch you guys in the very next episode peace out and have a great day everyone